everybody. Okay, I just wanted to make this really quick video on something that I've just figured out in Vroid. I had no idea it was an option, and I think that maybe a lot of other people don't realize it too. And it's a little bit more of an advanced thing, so if you're having trouble with it, hopefully I can help you. Let's take a look at it, okay? Okay, so basically I was on booth.pm looking for some winter clothing, and I came across this absolutely adorable winter jacket, and I was like, oh, I have to have that, it's so cute. So I went ahead and got it. But then the issue came with when I tried to put it on, the instructions weren't extremely clear. And usually I can figure it out really easily, but this one was so difficult. And I'll tell you why. Let's go through it. I'm gonna put on this outfit and show you exactly how it works. This is a great example to talk about this new feature that I figured out. Okay, so here I am in Vroid underneath the outfit tab. All right, I'm gonna go under tops to show you this, and I'm gonna go to custom items. And for this coat, you have to put on the hoodie, okay? So with the hoodie on, I'm gonna go to edit texture, and we're gonna be working, of course, with the map of the outfit, this default image here. We've talked about this in my other videos. If you haven't seen them, I'm gonna link up uh, the first video I did on Vroid clothing. Basically, what we have to do is we have to just import this new outfit that I got. All right, so we're gonna start with the coat, and I'm gonna bring in this jacket here. And voila, okay, super simple. It goes right on top of the hoodie with almost no problems. Looks great. All right, but now you can see that there's this empty space. All right, so simple enough, this spot is supposed to be for the scarf, all right? So what we're gonna do is we're gonna add a layer, easy peasy, and we're gonna import for the layer and go back here and go to the scarf one. And I wanna choose this scarf, all right? Voila! All right, so now we have the hoodie part. Now, what I couldn't figure out, though, was in this outfit, you can see that it's like a scarf, not just the hood. So you have this, like, scarf part here, and then you have the scarf that goes around the neck. And I was thinking, like, I know what that is. I know that in order to get that neck part, that I'm supposed to use the long coat collar shirt. So we have this different map here. Okay, so if I go and import, and then I go into my winter coats, and I go into the second scarf here. I'm gonna find that scarf again. And then I open it up. Okay, so it works perfect with this um, long coat. So that gives me that scarf. And I couldn't figure out how. How is this supposed to go together? Like, what do I do? It was really boggling me. And I'm like, somehow I have to get both the full coat over the hoodie. And I just couldn't figure out. I was like, that, that's impossible. I've never seen that possible. Because again, I'm still new to the new Vroid and I had been using the beta for a really long time. And I don't think this was an option in the beta. So I'm gonna close this. I'm gonna say close without saving. And we're gonna go back to my jacket here. Going back to edit texture. I'm gonna close that, we don't need to save that. This is what I figured out. Add a template. Oh my gosh, it's right there. It's right there in front of me and I didn't see it. I can't believe I didn't see it. But here it says you can stack up to five templates on top of each other. How cool is that? So now you can work outside of each map. You can add multiple maps on top of each other. So you can create all sorts of very interesting new outfits. You're not just stuck with one map. You can have multiple maps. So I'm gonna add this template and I'm gonna add that long coat. And then I'm just going to right click on the default design import and I'm gonna import that scarf. Ah, and voila! So then all you have to do is click on this part right here and that'll open up all of the different collar options and all of the slider tools on the right here, which is so cool! I can't believe it, this is really just making me so excited. Um, okay, so now we can play with the collar sag. Um, we're gonna clean this up a bit. And then I'm gonna do the same thing. I'm gonna click this little symbol here to bring up the slider tools for the hoodie. Okay, and there we go. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. So the fact that you can layer multiple maps on top of each other. I just thought that was the coolest thing ever and I really wanted to share it with you. Hopefully that helps the fact that just to even tell you guys that that's an option that you have now that you can play with in the new Vroid. Super cool. Okay, I'll talk to you guys on the next one. Lots of love, bye.